another build, another commentary. Uh, I thought I'd do another one. Should be a short one, this one. Um, so this is a fairy tale kind of witch type house. So think like Hansel and Gretel, um, like Baba Yaga. I think that's right. Um, I think she was a witch that lived in the swamp and this is a swamp build as well. So it's a tree house. You know, I wanted to build a tree house. I also wanted, I really like the swamp. I wanted to build something in the swamp. And this is what happened. Um, very thematic. It's not meant to be, it's kind of, no, sorry. Yeah, thematic. It's not really functional per se. Uh, you could sleep there, you could use it. You could tweak it as well. There's definitely some stuff you could get rid of and just like put a workbench there instead. Um, but anyway, yeah, that's why it's got this crazy chimney thing. That was a lot of shift clicking, by the way, like shifting the bricks around. And that's something I was going to do more of with the walls and everything, kind of pull the bricks out and make it look a, a bit kind of like rickety. Um, I think that's the, that would be the right word, but I was quite pleased with the chimney. Um, and there's, I don't know if you saw, but there's a little like, pumpkin. I left a little space for the pumpkin. And I left some of it open on the sides and stuff. I don't know if you'll see it. You should see it in the flyby, I think, somewhere. There's like a little open bed. This is the bedroom, which I call the pod. The main thing is an octagon. This is an octagon as well, octagon shape, some smaller one. Uh, this is just a framework of iron bars, wood in the middle. It uh, sort of um, tapers downward at the bottom because I've used roof pieces at the bottom to make it sort of taper downward. And then you've got the wood in the middle, you can see. That's a fire in the middle and you can see the octagon there as well. And I put the, uh, the purple candles in that say, to give it like a cool purple effect, you know, with idols around the outside. I just, you know, they look cool. And I popped a, a lantern on the top as well. Those purple candles, you see them um, again in a minute downstairs by the big fire. They are a magic station, magic crafting table upgrade. That I've been, I find myself using them quite a lot because I think they look cool, not just here, but in other ones. There's the lantern on the top. That's purely there just because I thought it looked good. All the design on the roof and everything is just there because I thought it looked good. I was thinking like pineapple for some reason for that roof and this roof on this main bit. And I'll explain why in a minute. Pineapple, sounds a bit random, but. So, uh, oh yeah, the, the floor has two levels. Most of it's all made out of black marble. The, the bottom level is black marble and I wanted to make it so you could still see the spiderweb frame. And then there's normal stone on the top just to create like a bit of a contrast. And also if there's two levels, it means you could put in stairs and stuff like that. I wanted a stairway to the front door and whatnot just because I thought it looked cool. I was really pleased with this front entrance, by the way. So those glowy spikes on the roof, um, those are black marble spikes with um, wisp lights embedded in the middle of them. That's why they glow. Uh, the fire, normally I would make like a normal looking fire. This one, I wanted to make it look a bit like an oven. You can see it's open on the side, which I feel makes it look a bit more like an oven. And this is the cage where the, the witch would keep her victims and those are two of my friends crying their eyes out um the squoky and burnt cookie in there there's a little feeding hatch on the side there purely to mag completely pointless really you could replace that for example with like a workbench area or something like that make it a bit more functional um there's the magic thing they're doing some ceremony um you can see the glowy roof bit up there as well don't know if you saw that um, trying to think what else there is to say about this bit. Uh, so the roof as well, I put like um, wooden crosses, kind of I embedded it in, you could probably see a little bit there. That's where I got the, that's why I'm saying pineapple. Because um, it, you know, I don't know, it gives it that rough pineapple thing. These are all like bookcases. Um, with magic paraphernalia. That's a race trophy on the wall, which I just thought looked cool. Kind of like, um, kind of like, uh, 
like the witch's cloak she's hung it up and this uh that's a forge upgrade that bucket and you can't really see it from that angle just now you saw the smoke coming out there's bile bombs that's a little i don't know if i came up with that idea i'm not i don't i didn't get that idea from anyone else i'm sure it's not original idea but if you put them in there you, it gives it like this smoke effect that i thought was kind of cool um i used some jarl trophies on either side of the door you can see them more towards the beginning um, and I left the back open because they're bright red on the back and I put some lights on the inside to kind of make it look like evil eyes don't know if it results in that um, I don't I don't know if it's obvious when you look at it I don't think it is but um, I, I thought it looked cool either way and they look cool when you're on the inside as well they kind of fit the theme these monster things um, I should probably mention now, oh yeah, this was like a random event that happened, we just kind of left it in. This thing turned up, so we just, just left it in. Enjoy the battle, only lasts a second I think. Um, I should probably say now, the song coming up is Wolf, it's like a kind of dark, bluesy type song, and I thought it just fit this, and I've kind of left you probably hear Wolf in the background while I'm talking as well, and then you'll hear the full song um, whenever I whenever I shut up. Yes, they are victorious. Uh, right. Yeah, I don't think there's much else to say, really. Um, if you enjoy the music, you can check out more in the links below. Um, Oh, there's all the glowy spikes and whatnot, and then you, you get a full view of the chimney. I really was happy with that chimney. And you can see the kind of pine... Maybe you get what I mean when I say pineapple with the wooden crosses. Right, oh, the music's dying. Thanks for watching. I've been wandering like a wild dog Not feeling like I have a home In the depths of this old wood Beneath the canopies of these ancients In this fastness, I can hear him calling. I can hear him calling me. They're calling me to join. As I meander I Deep into its sudden bowels And just before I'm swallowed up for good I realize that I'm haunted Haunted by an old friend Haunted by an old wolf And I can hear him calling It's him that I had called Did I wait so long for this? This year is the year I turn and face this wolf in the eye. 
take back what happened from his mouth to mine and make the moment where his eye turns from green to white. Thank you.